the way to improve the experience for everybody is to think about social media diversity. That's to say, why are there only two platforms? Why aren't there many? Um, and why is it that I have to use Twitter to interact with other Twitter users? I don't have to have a Vo Vodafone phone and a BT phone and an EE phone and an O2 <laughs> phone to, to talk to people across those networks. But when it's social media, we do. And that lack of interoperability creates the lack of social media diversity because you have to be on the platform in order to use it. And then you have to, ex to accept the experience and the content moderation rules. Everything becomes a terribly blunt in instrument. The experience becomes extremely arid in terms of the, uh, your ability to, to tweak how it, how it works and to kind of get the content you do and don't want. If we had competitors who were moderating in the, or, and, and prioritizing in a way that users felt was reasonable, then you would, get comp you would have competition on user experience. And that would mean that we would be able to solve these problems, at least partly through the market. Uh, it's not to say regulation isn't needed, but I think competition policy, as just as it is in traditional media, is extremely important to, ex to protect free expression. And we must not accept the idea that monopolies are just going to be governed through regulation and that will solve all the free expression issues, because it won't, no more than it would if we had two newspaper prior proprietors.